My name is Ruth James. I came from Sokoto State. Um, no, let me start. Um, sometime in the March, you know, before March, I have a breast lump. So, and I went to hospital and they diagnosed that I have a cancer of the breast. So I had a voice that says that I should come to Dunamis. I have never been to Dunamis. So when I had the voice and I said, okay. So I came to Dunamis um, March. So after, uh, it was on Wednesday, healing and deliverance service. Tuesday, healing and deliverance service. So I felt under the anointing. And I, after the program, I met one pastor and I showed him my medical report. And he prayed with me and said, go, you will come back with a testimony. So when I went back to Sokoto, they gave me an ultrasound to do. So after the ultrasound, I now take my report back to the doctor. So he now said that they have to operate me and make sure that they remove everything there. But the reason why I allowed him to carry on the operation, because I know that God has already touched me. And I know when, I, when he did that operation, my result will come up with a different result. So they carry on the operation. Um, then after then, they, they, they didn't give me my result for about three weeks. So I was not pursuing the result. I tell them about the result. They said I should send the formal result to them that about three doctors have sat on the, on the results. So I now send the first result to them. So finally, they now call me that I should come and pick it. So when I pick the result, I take it to where they say I should take it to radiotherapy, something like that. So when I went there, they said that there is no trace of cancer in what they remove. So after then, I, in my life, I have never known, I have only one kidney. Always if I go, doctor will say, do you know the problem that you have about your kidney? I will say yes. They used to tell me that I don't have one kidney. And this one now is the second testimony after the cancer. Yes. This one is the second testimony. So when, when I went for an ultrasound, then the doctor said I should lie down. So immediately I lied down. He just pressed this machine on my right hand side he now said that i can see your kidney it's just about uh, Pray, praise the lord after the encounter here went back checked no more cancer they said what they removed is no cancer for the first time they now checked after she left dunamis and they said we can now see your other kidney that has never been visible before and the size and, and everything is normal and she ran back from sokoto by fly to come and give the praise unto the Lord. That is, God removed the cancer and replaced a kidney. Hey! He removed what the devil put there and put what the devil took. You didn't hear what I just said. The devil put cancer. God took it. The devil took a kidney. God put it. That is the kind of God we serve. Tonight, God is going to take whatever the devil put in your body and he's going to put in your body what the devil took from you. Can somebody say amen like a believer? Look at your neighbor and say, God is going to put in your body is going to put in your life what the devil took from you and he will take from your life what the devil put in your life shout the loudest amen help me walk to seven people around you and tell them get ready for a testimony god is about to do something strange and new in your life get ready get ready get ready get ready get ready, get ready.